What is up guys, IGLZ here and welcome back to the Battle City map. Today we're standing outside of the Rose Red Manor and the reason being I've actually been working on this place for a little while and uh, yeah there's been a few improvements to show you guys and also I think I may have been working on something else, I can't quite put my finger on it, uh, yeah not much has gone on. Um, but I think I have done some work up here, not that much, um, but yeah, I've got some work done in the manor. Let's show you guys what I've done. So, of course, all this down here will be the same. I want to go the proper way up to the top, why not? Let's take the staircase, this strange staircase. I love that roof, I love it. So, the first thing you'll notice is that I'm flushing the hallways out a little. Let's just close these doors so you don't get any spoilers. Because I don't want to show that off yet. But, but yeah, I'm flushing out this area a little bit more. We've got some artwork on the walls. We've got so much stuff. We've got nice little seating. With uh, the doorway going into this area, which is quite dark. Let's not go in there. <laughs> and... I've done the same on the other side. I've got some more couches, tables, and some a giant piece of artwork here. <laughs> Can you guess what that is? <laughs> uh, we'll see how many of you guys guess, get that. How many of you guys can get what this is? Think about the colours. <laughs> it's blocky Minecraft, what can I say? So um, yeah, that's one thing I've done so far. This corridor here is something I've done just now. Uh, I'm liking it. It's making the hallway a little bit thinner, which I do like, but it's also giving it like a little bit extra depth. You've got the plants, tables. It just looks a lot more nicer, in my opinion. A little bit nicer. Um, now for the biggest thing that I've done so far. The bedroom. Yeah. You ready to see what I've been up to in the bedroom? Get those minds out the gutters, guys. <laughs> so, yeah. I flushed this place out a little bit. There's a lot of seating. I don't know whoever sleeps in this bedroom. I don't know why they off so many guests in their own bedroom. I don't know. But it sort of feels right for these master bedrooms. There'll be a lot of seating. Don't know why. Don't know why I've made these bedrooms so large. Kind of like a bed sit type of thing. But we've got the whole bed thing here, which looks awesome. I showed this off in a previous episode. But I've put some like bookshelf cabinets here. I've got a couple of chests in there that you can't access. Twelve chests. <laughs> uh, some seating so you can read a book whilst looking out and onto the balcony. If you so wish. Uh, same on the other side. We've got another bookcase here with some greenery, a couple of tables. Uh, we've got another entrance into here that you saw a little bit of a spoiler off. We've got a couple more settees, a table, a plants. Yeah, some artwork on the walls. Why not? <laughs> and we've got, I don't know, is this a good mirror or is it a uh, I'll work. I don't know. Kind of looks like a mirror to me. <laughs> kind of looks like a mirror. But uh, yeah guys, what do you think of the bedroom? I've spent a little bit of time here. It's nowhere near done. Nowhere near done. It feels still a st it still feels a little empty. Need some more character in this place. Uh, maybe changing the colours of the settees a little bit might be a good idea. Uh, but yeah, it's, I think I think I'm happy with this, so far. So far. A little bit of messing up to do. Come on. Whose bedroom is very neat, anyway? <laughs> Gotta make it look like it's been lived in. At least. Uh, 
gotta do the same over here as well, make this place look like it's been lived in. But yeah. What do you guys think of the improvements of the Red Rose Manor? Or Rose Red Manor, I can't quite remember which way I've called it. <laughs> been that long. Oh. Uh, there's been another one I've done as well. This door right here goes into this little seating area. It's like an outdoor seating area. I've done a roof up here. It's looking nice. There's now two ways in and out of this place, so you don't have to go all the way around the balcony. Especially on this side, since it's very... This chimney is here. <laughs> um, but I've done the same on the other side as well, where there's now two ways in and out of this place. And it's no longer a sealed place. I do like this ceiling. I've got to do this ceiling more often. I'm loving it. Yeah, guys, what do you think? Not much has been done, but I think uh, I've been doing quite well so far. Uh, this manor has been a huge work in progress for a very long time. It's not even funny. So, getting back to work on it is just a good thing. Very good thing. Still can't wait to play the hidden on this place. In this place, should I say. I've even got all of the stuff ready for it. We've got the bows, we've got the swords, we've got the baked potatoes, and we've got the arrows, and we've got the hidden stuff, the feather falling boots, the night vision, the invisibility, and the potion of leaping, ender pearls, food, and the swords, not back, and sharpness. The swords are called the hidden, of course. <laughs> so, yeah, guys. What do you guys think of the manor? Ah, awesome. There was one other thing I want to talk about in this episode, guys, and that is Minecon. Now, I was watching the live stream of Minecon and I saw all of the stuff that they were talking about for your Studios panel. Ah, oh, talk about a headache at the end. No offense to any of you who may have been at Minecon, who may be watching this video. But there was a lot of questions that was asked that just didn't need to be asked. I think that's the most polite way I can say it. Um, but yeah. No mention on things that really needed to be asked. <laughs> but uh, at least we can be excited for a few things that's coming out in the uh, console edition. Like the bone block I've been looking forward to. I do like my white blocks as you can see. It's like, yeah, the bone block is going to work a lot, a lot brilliantly for building something like this. <laughs> ah, this is all made out of quartz, as you can see. Imagine it out of bone block. It will look amazing. Oh, so much more detail I can put on this place. Of course, I won't. We'll see in Gaia. Why we'll do the bone block. But uh, yeah, guys, we've got a few things to look forward to. I do like the uh, new mythology pack that's coming out. That looks amazing, I have to admit. I do like my Chinese mythology type of thing. I love their architecture, everything to do with it. Even the dragons. The dragons look majestic. Uh, the world itself, I'm going to explore. That is one of the only worlds I really want to explore and put up onto YouTube. So I will be doing that, so I look forward to do for that when that pack comes out. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Before we end the video, I'll show you what I've been up to in here. Not much has changed except... No, I don't think there's much that's changed. I think I've raised this uh, little mount to go up to the corner, and that's it. Uh, might have shown that in the last episode. Other than that, I think uh, this is the rest that's all, all that's been done. And that's it. Be sure to smash that like button if you enjoyed this video and if you have. And also subscribe to keep up to date on all of my videos, guys. And support my channel. Thank you all so much for watching. And support my channel. I'll see you guys next time.